Chorus. Bas, they they better avenge. Please. Tafadhali. Why, so, why so are things, you yeah. sending why? children to avenge their seniors' problem? Because they're a better side. They are, no, they're a better side. They're, they're trying to do the Gen Z thing with your older generation. <laughs> ha! <laughs> 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 That's what's going Salale. on. <laughs> <laughs> Salale. Uh, as soon as I said that, I knew I'd set myself up. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah, it's a good squad. Uh, we have uh, Brian Omondi in goal. Amos Onjala starts again together with uh, Sylvester Wino in the middle of... The, of the defense, then Alphonse Omija, who played for Harambe Stars in the qualifiers, and was he gets, decent, and he was really good. I'm impressed. Uh, he gets the nod. Uh, then uh, we have a new entrant uh, that is uh, Polo Chuoga. Then Crispin Erambo, Jono Chieng, Austin Odiambo, Rooney Onyango is the captain once again. Patrick Otieno and Benson Omala. But uh, looks like uh, there are a few changes to the squad because now that Ochoga has started, means that Rooney is going to be playing as a winger. Yeah, possibly because mm-hmm. it's it's Geoffrey Onyango who's been dropped uh-uh. who played yes. as a left back. So maybe Paul even slots in a left back. We'll see. That lineup sounds very defensive. It is. Sounds very defensive. It is. But you know, it's it's Rooney. It's Rooney who's a defender, but he is now playing in midfield. So it's yeah, looking that way. But it's 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 four defenders. <laughs> No, but it's just. <laughs> I mean, he, he's put four centre backs. It's, it's defensive. It's, it's it sounds defensive, but it's okay again because that's how Kenya boxes. Kenya boxes defensively. We, 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 mm. we, we, let's not kid ourselves. Eh? Yes. We are not uh, Germany and we are not Ghana. We don't. We, we play defense. <laughs> yeah. We sit. We stay compact, compact. Plus, I know Ken, my bomb. Compact, mm. compact, 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 and then we go forward. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I have a lot of respect for Ken. Yeah. A lot. Ken yeah. was in that famous Fabish team. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Hey, hey. Ken could <laughs> play, by the way. Mm-hmm. Hey, make no mistake. Mm. Ken, Ken could play. That left, that left wing back. Ah, bad news. Mm. Man, a bad man. Ken could play. I have a lot of respect for Ken. Mm. Yes, my bomb. That's yeah. it. Next time you see him, call him my bomb. Uh, <laughs> just tell him, ah, my bomb. And you'll see, you'll see his reaction. He's going to go like, this guy knows. Ah, that's my guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I have a lot of respect for Ken. Uh, and I hope he does well. Um, I hope the emerging stars do well. I need some hope. I was asking you guys off here. Uh, Amos Wanjala, is he okay? Are, did, are you guys seeing something? Yes. Mm. I'm, I'm impressed. I It started with the... Uh, it's actually really funny. A year ago, he never ever rep- represented the national team. But now, a year later, he's played for the under-18s. Now he's playing for, uh, actually, it's under-20. Mm-hmm. And now he's playing for the under-23. under-23. He played, he captained his side to the nationals in uh, last year in Kakamega. He he was victorious to, with the under-20. Unfortunately, they didn't get to win it, but he, they reached the final. Yeah. And so we can see the progression. First half in the, in the game against... Um, Exactly. Zambia wasn't too good for him. A bit of mispasses here and there, unnecessary long balls. But he settled in the second half, had a good display, was at it, green confidence, and I'm 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 expecting him to have a better game against Comoros. Mm. Yes, chap. Yeah, and maybe just a, a quick question now, because uh, from that that team in in Kakamega, also have Aldrin Kibet. Mm-hmm. I think he's been is on the bench. Yeah. yeah, I don't know what you think of him so far. He hasn't started. Yeah, in, I I, I don't think he would he would have yeah. made the team uh, in the f- in the first eleven. But <laughs> mm. um, why are you smiling, Muka? <laughs> 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 but I want to see him. I want it's to see. Him. Here. No, <laughs> I, I, I want to here. see. I want to see the progress mm. because he's young. He's uh, he's not he's, he's not at uh, twenty. <coughs> so he's playing with the under twenty three. He's playing with guys who have played in the league for for quite some time he's competing against for example Austin Odiambo Austin Odiambo has been in the league for the past 4 years he's played for AFC Leopards he's played for Gormaya he he knows Did how to handle something the pressure. like Austin Odiambo who could be headed abroad yes yeah. he could be headed abroad and and you mm. and in the game against Zambia you saw why he potentially could move abroad because you know, he the way he picks his passes he passes the way the passes the type of the passes really good you know who he reminds me of who this is not a good comparison Ozil? No. Trick Daddy. Ah! He reminds me it's of not Trick a good, Daddy. It's not a good company. He reminds me of <laughs> yeah, Kevin yeah, yeah, yeah. In this sense, yeah. there is no doubting his talent. Yes. Guys, you guys, I don't know whether you know how good Kevin Omondi was. I watched him in Esperance. 
Man, no, that's juicy. Uh, the, no, no, not this Uko. juicy. The, la- the first time Esperance yes. came to Nyayo Stadium. Yes. He was the best player on the pitch that day. I don't know whether you know how good Trick Daddy was. There's a reason he was called Trick Daddy. Yeah. Kevin could play. He had everything. Right foot, left foot, size, physique, everything. Mm. But one thing. <laughs> the most important one. Eh? Yes. Kujituma. Mm. Like... That uh, that desire and want to be the best. and to, he, he, I once remember a God fan putting it on their Facebook page. That he feels like he should go to training and beat him up. <laughs> because he doesn't think... This was this is many years ago. This mm. might be 2011 or 2010. And he was like, I don't think even he knows how much talent he has. Trick Daddy mm. was mm. supremely gifted. Mm-hmm. I feel the same about Austin. There's any time I've watched, the few times I've watched him play, mm. you can tell he's a cut above everyone else. Yes. Like, he's on a different level. Yeah. But it's the application and the and the desire and the push. That's why I'm so happy he's going abroad. Mm. Because I he feel if he gets himself. that right, yeah. Yeah. Hey, he's a talented kid. Ah, Sana. Like, you watch him, you go like, oh, oh. wow. Mm. Like, we have some, we have some. Special. Mm. So I just hope he can continue the progression yes mm. like get into the national team go abroad just go because we need those talents to get exposed yeah. Yeah. there's no doubt his talent yes. austin is brilliant mm. and and that's why i said when i see him i just think of trick daddy mm. because kevin omondi could play you guys think blackberry could play hey, trick man. daddy hey, oh, oh. Oh, on the oh, first oh. season we have blackberry man huh? you remember the first season? i know he let your boy figure and you wing um, <laughs> I'm sure you can remember. I remember. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Smooth like a black bear. <laughs> anyway, so uh, but but good 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 stuff. I hope they build on it. I also know you like Brian. Yes, I, li- I like Brian. Brian. I like Brian because yes. of his physique, his distribution. He can pick a pass. His distribution is really good because he just mm. doesn't clear the ball or hoof it forward. No, he's precise. If I'm hitting it, I'm hitting it to our player that's what i like about him he's um he says he could do better but he can we have a player there we, for the next like 10 years if he continues well we have a good keeper 